Morning guys, I am up Adam. I've been up for a while editing videos, but now it is almost time to exercise. But before I exercise, you know what I gotta do? And that's have a zip fizz. And what is this? Peach mango, absolutely. Okay guys, like we talked about last time, peach mango is the one and only flavor I think that has maltodextrin in it. So like be extra careful if you're sensitive to maltodextrin. I am going to do a blood glucose test specifically for peach mango. I did a Zip Fizz blood glucose test a long time ago. You can see it right here. Uh, it didn't affect my uh, blood glucose at all, but it definitely did not have maltodextrin in it either. So I'm gonna be checking on this one, but it's not bad enough, at least I haven't tested yet, so I'm hoping, but it's not something that's gonna stop me from having it today. So let's get going. All right, guys, let's get ready to shake it in three, two, one. To finishing the month strong. Can you believe September is almost over? Like, where did the year go? But that's okay. We don't fear time passing, okay? Because that's just one more day for us to reach our goals. That's one more day closer to our goals. So let's do this for the end of September and the rest of the year. Let go. Mmm. Mmm, peach mango so good. It's so good. Oh, the mountain dextrin. Milton, you sleepy? You sleepy already? What have you done? You you literally just woke up. You just woke up, Mamiya. Milton, give me paw. Good boy. Good boy, smart boy. Oh, okay. That uh, also food. Okay. Good boy, Tinkus. Okay guys, it is time to eat. This is a cheeseburger salad. It was a cheeseburger in a bowl just a minute ago, but I went ahead and chopped that thing up because I'm about to dig into this with a fork. Okay, so we have a bed of lettuce and then we have our burger, we have cheese, we have bacon, we have onion, we have mayo, we have mustard, we have hot sauce. Oh my goodness, I like to call this the Five Guys imitation special. This is exactly what I would get if I was at Five Guys. You can make a pretty darn near close thing at your house and this is about to be fire. Oh my God. The umami from the burger mixed with the, the light cool crunchiness of the lettuce with the creaminess of the mayo and that zing from the hot sauce. By far one of my favorite meals. We'll do the trick every single time i'm about to eat this and then i have like a lot of stuff to eat today so that's exciting but can't think about that got my eyes set on this okay back for round two with this delicious chicken salad right here and then i got some max red hot pork rinds i've never had the max pork rinds before so i'm actually gonna take a little bit of chicken salad put it on a pork rind see how that goes Crunchy, creamy, delicious. I'm actually looking forward to having my chicken salad wrapped up in my egg thin. So I'm gonna attempt a one-handed wrap here. Yo, 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 my name is Autumn. You get it, one-handed wrap. I killed myself on that one. That one was genius. The almonds and the relish and the grapes and the good amount of red pepper that I put in this thing, like winner, winner, chicken salad dinner. Okay, before I finish out my eating window with a Bulletproof coffee, I am going to have a nut butter packet from High Key Snacks. This is coconut plus MCT damia. Ha ha, see what you did there. Contains macadamia, pecan, hazelnut, coconut. That's about it. <sighs> per the directions, knead and squeeze before opening. Ah yes, nut butter. Give them the old knead and squeeze. That's probably my least favorite thing about enjoying nut butters in a packet at least, is like you have to do like 10 minutes of work before you can get to the actual product. Oh, I don't like working for my food. That's why I don't like crab, lobster. Anything that I gotta break a sweat to get into is not worth it. I'm gonna hit you with the old SpongeBob again. 2,000 years later. Okay, I feel that this is acceptably homogenous, so now I'm gonna open it. Mmm, man, coconutty, nutty, sweet. This is 
is really good and it takes a while to eat so that makes me feel very satisfied what is this like a tablespoon or something this is just two tablespoons but like it's gonna take me forever to get through so i really do like the individual packaging mm, yeah Okay guys, as annoying and cumbersome as I find bulletproof coffee to make, like, I really do enjoy it. This is delicious. I have 12 ounces of coffee, I have a tablespoon of butter, I have a cup of almond milk, I have some of that preferred keto chocolate collagen. I put a squirt of pure in there. It is no Lakanto by any means. I stand by that. I still haven't ordered my Lakanto and I'm upset about that. So thank you for reminding me I'm gonna do that today. You too can order Lakanto. You can use my link in the description box below as well as I have a discount code, but like that monk fruit. Got some HWC in here. I'm drinking this so that I can close out my eating window. This is a significant amount of calories. Hashtag not a low calorie food. Also, I've been sipping this ice drink, this pink grapefruit, so I'm gonna finish that out. I am gonna have some more water and I will show you that as proof and I'll probably have a piece of gum. And then later on, I will have that Sprite Zero and some Jello, and we'll call it a day. Okay, I really want a piece of gum, but I'm also committed to drinking a lot of water. So like, I have to get my water to like right here before I can have that gum. So I'm gonna attempt a large portion of that now. Oh, that was a fail. The water's so cold, my teeth. I mean, that's like four ounces, right? I mean, that's four ounces, okay. Okay, that's all I can do for right now, but I'm still having a piece of gum anyway. Afternoon snack of champions. Okay guys, it is snack time. I have my Jello. And I have my Sprite Zero. Not gonna lie, I love Sprite Zero. I love it better than every flavor of Zevia, but <laughs> I'm not the biggest fan of aspartame. It definitely doesn't bother me to have once in a blue moon like I am this week, but I do recognize that I don't want to be drinking it every day. So Zevia is a great alternative and I'm not complaining, but oh no, Sprite Zero. What will I do now? I did want to talk about the Rebel Ice Cream from my meal prep video i said in that video that i'd let you know how i felt about it in this video and guys wow like i had the peanut butter fudge it was so peanut it was more of a peanut butter chip i was expecting like a chocolate with a peanut butter swirl the way that the enlightened chocolate peanut butter is but this is a peanut butter based ice cream with fudge chips in it and it was so good. I let it sit in the refrigerator for about an hour while I was at the gym and when I came home it was still pretty solid so I let it sit out for like 15 or 20 minutes and like it was the creamiest, smoothest, most delicious thing like definite favorite. Can definitely go back to the store and buy seven of those and be okay but the thing is I still have so many more in the freezer to try but by far that has been my favorite. I've had the butter pecan and it was good, but like this one knocked it out of the park. I'm looking forward to the other flavors. Okay guys, I am finishing up for the day. I've started this little tradition lately of having like a couple of spicy pickles or one big pickle spear at night. It's zero calories, one gram of carb. I'm not counting it as breaking my fast. I mean, everything that I've read about fasting for weight loss says that like if it's not over 50 calories, it pretty much doesn't count. And I'm just choosing to go with that, okay? So I'm having one pickle spear, bold and spicy, great salty way to end the night, and that's that. Overall, great meal prep this week. Like the burger is delicious. That chicken salad is delicious. Just everything is so good. This is about 1800 calories and it is filling and I love it. Okay guys, well that's it for me today. I'm gonna go enjoy my pickle and watch some football and call it a night. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you like it, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel, Watch Out on Keto. I make weekly meal preps, weekly what I eat Wednesdays, monthly weigh-ins, monthly keto crate unboxings, and the occasional product review and recipe. You can also find me on Instagram, Facebook, and Patreon at Watch Out on Keto. Thanks, and I'll see you next week. Mmm! Oh, it is bold and spicy. Oh, yeah.